good morning and happy Thursday. So I didn't go for a run this morning. Um, I had a really bad night's sleep. So I'm going to swap my days around and I'm going to go tomorrow and Sunday instead, um, which kind of works out anyway, because I'm working at the office tomorrow and um, Carl has some appointments, so I can't take the car. And I finished like an hour earlier than, no, I finished half an hour earlier than him tomorrow, but um, if he finishes up working from home, then we're like five miles away. So it could be six o'clock before he picks me up. So that's fine. Cause I can use that time then instead rather than just sitting around waiting or whatever. So not a problem, we should switch things up. Um, and also it's raining and cold. So sort of double works out. But yeah, very tired this morning. So I've made my beanies. I've got a very vanilla um, and Carl has decided he doesn't want any. So I have the hazelnut in my bag to take to work. Um, that I also got today, and now I need to go make myself look semi-human. Wish me luck. Managed to, I think successfully, fake human. Oh, apart from that wispy. Time to get my butt to the office. What a day. I'm home though. That was a faff. It's like 20 past six. I don't know where I've been for like the last hour. It's ridiculous. I finished at half five and I must have left fairly close to. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I don't know. However, so to show you this, cause it's quite funny. I just stopped in Aldi on the way home, which is obviously where I've been. Um, and I bought these for Carl as a little snack. Let me just show you exactly how many are in here. Like, big tub, reasonable tub. Like, where are the snacks? Oh no, on the floor apparently. We rescued it. I mean, all oh, they smell good. They smell really good. But yeah, not not so much in the way of snacks in here. There you go. Look how cute my tree looks. I can't remember to turn it on at four, I think, ish. Also, he corrected my math after <laughs> I signed out last night. Um, I said it, they would be on for eight hours. Ah, oh, are you the gift? Are you the gift? Um, and then off for 16. Yeah, basically I had the numbers the wrong way around. So yeah, they're on at four. They should go off about midnight. Um, and now I need to go to the shop to send the work post because I didn't get around to doing that. And then I still need to edit yesterday's vlog before I get onto anything for tonight. So tonight's just going to be our usual amount of chaos, which is why I went to Audi. So hello. Um, so I could get us a pizza. Um, so we can have a nice quick, easy dinner. And then I can do that in amongst all the other carnage that I need to sort out. Little update on these. There might not be many in there, but what is in there are really, really nice, actually. You never know with things like this if they're going to be, like, dry brownie, but it's actually a really nice soft gooey brownie wrapped in chocolate. So, yeah, I actually recommend these. <sighs> I'm still procrastinating, but Carl's just pointed out he needs to go to the shop anyway, so he's going to take my work post. I'm going to resort these lights because they're loosened themselves overnight and get yesterday's vlog edited because they need to do it. Also, this dog is now just... Oh, thank you so much. That was so cute. He's been a sob because he wants his dinner. Ah, uh, no, I said the word. Oops. But yeah, pizza's in, vlog edited. Let's do it. Okay, dinner consumed, adulting done, vlog done. Well, I say adulting done. Carl's going to put the bins out for me in a minute and hoover the hall stairs because that's our Thursday hit list. Um, I think that's pretty much the like need to do's for tonight got an order I need to pack up for our um, online shop and then I'm going to wrap some presents. I'm going to wrap Steffi and Dave's and my work friends that I didn't do last night because last night was just chaos. Um, but I just thought to show you, Carl's rearranged our lounge and um, actually I think it looks a bit better than how I had it so fair play. So ignore the carnage of wires and dog toys and stuff that'll get put away in a minute. What are you doing? Um, but he's just moved well, basically cleared this corner back out and moved this chair down from there and then this one can go across so we do have to walk around to come in here but that's not not really a problem but yeah it's um quite cute and cozy now actually let me see if I can so yeah all cute and obviously my tree I'm really disappointed because I forgot to see what it looked like from outside when I came home tonight but I have to go out again tomorrow so hopefully I'll remember to look and these two are just that they're gonna play now. 
Also, my work friend that I talked about had the same idea, so she's given us a Christmas card and presents, which obviously I will pop under the tree. I don't really know where I'm putting the cards yet this year. I haven't decided, so I'm going to open it up anyway and uh, decide where to pop it. Sat my butt down. Um, I'm going to wrap these presents and watch yesterday's film. I also found out my Christmas phone case, so I'm going to pop that on my phone because it's cute and why not? Um, but yeah, so yesterday's film was, I think it was a Holiday Inn or something like that. So I'm going to pop that on and wrap these presents and then I'll let you know what we thought of the film. That's tonight's little stack of wrapping done. I've got my friends to drop into work and Steffi and Dave's, which I want to get in the post on Saturday. Um, this isn't wrapped because it's actually something we just picked up for Steffi. <laughs> so um, yeah, that's to go for them. And yeah, I'll drop that in the office tomorrow. I also have some Christmas cards upstairs, so when I get up next, I will go and get them. But for now, I'm just gonna sit on the sofa for a minute because my back hurts from sitting on the floor wrapping, but at least they're done and they look cute. Also, I've just sat on the sofa with my blanket and uh, my dog appears to have lost her head. Where did you go? You sleepy? Okay, she's done with my nonsense. So we've just finished watching, what was it called? It was a, My Christmas Inn? Yeah. Yeah. That's what the film actually was for yesterday. Um, the plot was very, very similar to... What was the one before? Christmas Land. Um, very similar plot, but I do think that one was slightly better than Christmas Land. Do you think... I don't know. Oh. I gave Christmas Land a six and a half to a seven out of ten. I'd give that one probably a seven. So we're not talking like massively better, but it was a little better to me. I think you're being a bit high on the scores of both for your film. Oh, okay. He really doesn't like them, apparently. Um, and now tonight's film, because we are catching up, is Christmas Inheritance, which we have actually seen before, um, but that's quite funny. I quite liked that last year, so I don't mind re-watching that. And we're going to go and watch that one in bed, because why not? And also, it's like 20 past 10 again, so at least if we go and watch it in bed, we can wind down. Um, we already know we like that one, but I can't think what I would score it, so I will tell you after I've watched it.